Ah, you're going to love this next Wednesday night is the launch of Australia's first swimsuit fashion week at Sanctuary Cove, the gorgeous Gold Coast. And it has landed some of the biggest designers from around the world. This morning, we're getting a sneak peek from a designer whose collection is debuting. We welcome Lisa Burke. Good morning, Lisa. Welcome to the show. Good morning, Kerry. It almost seems as if we're over summer, but finding swimsuits, the best swimsuit with some of the best bodies has got to be exciting. Where do you get your vision from? Well, my vision has come from my life experiences. Mm -hmm. um, the actual label was born out of a dream I had several years ago. I was very fortunate to swim with humpback whales in Tonga. So if you could imagine coming face to face with a 15 metre, 40 tonne mother humpback and her baby in front of her, who came right up to my face. And in that moment, I knew that I had to do something to help the whales and dolphins. Well, because a lot of your money uh, you're dedicating to um, research. And of course, this week, you know, we saw the sad vision, uh, but the good news that, uh, uh, is it Nari, the, the dolphin who was attacked by a shark? It's now been nursed uh, at, uh, at the fabulous place uh, on the Gold Coast Sea World. Now, uh, dear Nari, being attacked by a shark, but I mean, this is where some of your, um, uh, your kind conservation work will go as well. Uh, yes, Nari was actually helped by the research rescue team mm -hmm. at SeaWorld, which is um, one of the few places in Australia that have the funds to be able to help rehabilitate the animals back into the wild. And they did an operation mm -hmm. on him, which was successful, mm -hmm. which is great. My label is giving 25% to help protect the whales and dolphins. Beautiful. Specifically this year we're donating to the Australian Whale Conservation Society. Well that's all great news. Mm -hmm. uh, good cause, beautiful work, but I tell you the boys on the floor here are just hanging out for some of these uh -huh. swimsuits. So uh, yeah. let the parade begin. Mm -hmm. um, so your vision again, you've, you've got some, um, some great background and some really interesting models you're using on your fashion parade, but tell us about the first one. This is part of the Goddess range, mm -hmm. which is an absolutely stunning, striking, very glamorous, um, flatters the figure, is suitable for all ages and body types. I think it's In suitable for all people who don't have peekaboo bits hanging out the side. I think that one looks pretty gorgeous. <laughs> and Some of us may have a little bit more flesh hanging out there than others, but... That's, yes, <laughs> um, the fabric is imported from Italy. It's a beautiful, soft fabric. So is this a lycra fabric, so it does, you know, trim and keep the body in? I mean, yes, is that one of yes, the keys absolutely. in swimsuit? Yes, definitely, yes. Mm -hmm. And colours this year, and I know you've named a lot of your um, uh, designs after, you know, uh, things that you've done on holiday or moments from your life. Yes. Um, okay, there's a few bikini stories mm -hmm. uh, this, this season, and this is the goddess range another one is called from the dream time which you will see a bikini from shortly mm -hmm. that was inspired um, from a painting by an aboriginal man who is one of the last remaining whale dreamers in wow. australia and so together him and i uh, have the same cause to help save the whales and dolphins mm -hmm. so i've been inspired by his, his artwork mm -hmm. and in our brochure this season you'll see Tamara Flanagan she is an, a stunning Aboriginal model it's her first wow. time modeling ever and she will be at the show as well at Sanctuary Cove beautiful there, so, there's yeah. um, uh, a picture of Tamara there yes looks stunning yeah. looks stunning and that's one of the artists there how fabulous Okay, colours for the season. Now, of course, these are all swimsuits we're going to see on, on, on our beaches next summer. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of blue. Mm -hmm. um, oh, you've got to say, black looks great. We all love black. Yeah. Now, this is very flattering. Okay, all girls watching who want to disguise figure flaws, your advice? Um, just when looking for a swimsuit, it's really important to pick the right cut. And we spend a lot of time working on getting the right cut. Okay, if you don't have a real waist and you've got a figure that probably just goes up and down, what's your advice? Well, something like this is great because it gives a bit of a curve mm -hmm. um, and it, the back is fantastic mm. um, with the, the crossover. Do you need a degree to get into them? <laughs> Sometimes no, it's you put not, it's not that hard actually, it looks, <laughs> looks hard. <laughs> Sometimes you just go, how does this work? I can't yeah, figure out how to get into it. <laughs> Um, okay, for someone who hasn't, that's a good idea. What if you've got to, oh, now this is, okay, thumbs up, boys. What do we like here? <laughs> Let me hear some comments.